Welcome back to Carnades.org. Today we're going to be continuing with our series, Three Months of Modal Logics, a sequel to the 100 Days of Logic, or kind of a Logic 201, for those of you who want a little bit more of an advanced logic seminar. So, today we're going to be continuing with Deontic Logic, looking at the Deontic Equivalence Axiom. We're going to kind of start on some of the axioms that are present and important to Deontic Logic. So... Now that we understand something of the meaning of the terms of deontic logic, we're going to add some axioms that allow them to function in our logical framework. The first axiom is just going to support our definitions directly. So, we have P is equivalent to Q implies it's obligatory that P is equivalent to it's obligatory that Q. So, basically, if two propositions, P and Q, are equivalent, we may conclude that P being obligatory is equivalent to Q being obligatory. Hopefully this makes some kind of intuitive sense, but just in case it doesn't, let's look at a bit of an example. So, Patel will push the button if and only if Njai does, implies that it is obligatory that Patel push the button if and only if it is obligatory that Njai does as well. So if these two people will only do these things if the other one does, if it is obligatory that one of them does it, it must be obligatory that the other one does it as well, and vice versa. If using this axiom in proofs, I'm going to refer to it as the DEA, or Deontic Equivalence Axiom. Once more, the axiom states that if we have P is equivalent to Q, we can conclude from that it's obligatory that P is equivalent to it's obligatory that Q. Okay? Up next, we're going to be doing a special bonus video here on contradiction and tautology notation to help us kind of understand deontic logic. I'm going to throw it in as an extra video because it's not directly related to deontic logic, and then we'll get back on track with our normal series on deontic logic. Watch this video and more here at Carnegie's.org and watch a new video on modal logics every single day for the next three months here at Carnegie's.org and stay skeptical everybody.